Before the Schwind Amaris came onto the market, standard eye trackers only adjusted lateral eye movements in the first and second dimensions. In surgical practice, the cornea rotates along the eyeball's rotational center. This causes a displacement between pupil center and the intended ablation center. In a process new to refractive surgery, the Schwindamaris eye tracker balances all those eye rolling displacements in the third and fourth dimension. The fifth dimension describes the cyclotorsion of the eye. The static and dynamic cyclotorsion control, pioneered by the Schwindamaris, compensates for torsional differences of the eye between a patient in upright and supine position as well as torsional movements of the eye during the ablation process. In addition to pupil recognition, the limbus is also simultaneously detected. If the center of the pupil shifts due to various light conditions, the eye tracker of the Schwint Amaris compensates for this. The Schwint Amaris combines a 1050 Hz turbo eye tracker with new ground-breaking features. The consequence is a uniquely exact compensation of every eye movement on into the fifth dimension. 